As students are settling back into the classroom, Fairfield Community School District Superintendent Art Sadoff says the district will be seeing a lot of new changes this school year that will benefit both students and teachers. Uh, we have a big middle school lighting and HVAC project which is nearing completion. Uh, they're com completing the work around the students as we're going along. Everybody's having to be flexible and cooperate there, but that's going to be great. That's going to provide uh, much improved air quality and air conditioning and heating and cooling for the middle school. The Lincoln Center is now home to the Regional Career Academy, which opened this fall, that will be offering three strands of college credit for students that will help them with college and career readiness. We also have a Young House Behavior Program at that Lincoln Center, which is something we haven't had before to serve students in grades 5 through 12. Uh, which will cut down on our busing of students to other districts and, and help with transitions. Uh, we have our preschool under the same roof at Washington Elementary for the first time this year, so that's been a transition as well. And we're uh, gearing up to make sure that uh, on our site visit uh, next school year that we meet the Iowa Quality Standards for Preschools programs. Sadhoff says he wants to continue to focus on student achievement. The high school's ACT scores were just released, the best the district has seen in 12 years, Sadoff says, adding that they far exceeded the state average. It's an exciting time for, for Fairfield schools. Um, we're, we're addressing many needs in our curriculum and our facilities and uh, really working hard to improve uh, the educational experience for students and we're excited to be able to do that and I'm, I'm excited to be able to help lead some of those changes. Reporting in Fairfield, Iowa, I'm Tess Hedrick for KTVO.